Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is Katie and I'm the organic esthetician. In my last video, I shared something that I say often as an esthetician. When it comes to at-home skincare devices, you really only need two categories of devices to see real clinically proven change in the skin. Microcurrent and LED light therapy. Last week, we did a deep dive into microcurrent and why the Zip Halo is my go-to handheld microcurrent device for home use. So in today's video, we're gonna dive into the other half of that duo, LED light therapy. We're gonna talk about how LED light therapy actually works in the skin, why it's so foundational to cellular health, and how you can use it at home in the same way I do in my treatment room. And because timing's everything, Current Body is currently running their biggest sale of the year for Black Friday, and they are offering 20% off site-wide, including all of their at-home LED light therapy devices, which are are coincidentally some of my favorite and my code Katie CB can be used on all of them so I'm gonna put my links and my code in the show notes down below I'll be breaking down the savings and all of current body's LED light therapy options later in this video feel free to use the chapters to jump ahead if you want to dive right into what your sale options are otherwise keep watching to find out what LED light therapy actually does in the body so what is LED light therapy? LED stands for light emitting diode, but the concept that we really wanna focus on is photobiomodulation, which is what LED does. It's the light influencing biology. That's what we're doing when we're using these gadgets at home. LED delivers light in specific wavelengths to the skin. That light is then absorbed by the mitochondria, the powerhouse of your cells, specifically an enzyme called cytochrome C oxidase. You don't really need to know that. What you do need to know is that this absorption triggers the production of ATP, adenosine triphosphate, which is your cellular energy, which lets your skin repair faster, heal better, and function more efficiently. If you've watched any of my other videos, specifically on microcurrent, you are familiar with ATP. Microcurrent is really effective at stimulating this cellular energy, but it is not alone in this endeavor. Light therapy also activates the production of ATP, which is why it's so beneficial to skin health because it's supporting cellular health. It increases blood flow, regulates inflammation, improves lymphatic movement, and supports the skin barrier. So instead of pushing or forcing change, LED creates the conditions for the skin to repair itself. Different wavelengths target different layers of the skin. So LED light therapy devices usually come in various colors from blue to green to red to deep red to infrared. And what you need to know about these wavelengths is that the longer the wavelength, the deeper it penetrates. So on your scale of light wavelengths, blue is the shortest wavelength only penetrating into the pore, not into the deeper layers of the skin. And on the other end of the spectrum is infrared, which is actually past the visible light spectrum, offering the deepest wavelength, going all the way down to the bone, making it especially well suited for targeting inflammation and pain management. So usually after the color is listed, it'll be followed by the depth or length of the wave. So red light is around 633 nanometers. It boosts collagen, improves circulation, reduces redness, and evens tone. Near infrared light is around 830 nanometers. And again, this works deeper into the dermis, calming inflammation and increasing repair. Deep near infrared, close to 1,072 nanometers in length, is one of the most advanced wavelengths 
used. It reaches the deeper fascia and is incredibly anti-aging. A quick note on blue light. I personally am not a fan of using blue light on the skin. While blue light is incredibly helpful at treating bacterial or fungal acne, specifically targeting the P. acneus bacteria, it is not discerning. So it's going to neutralize all the bacteria in the treatment area. And when it comes to the microbiome of the skin, it's not about neutralizing bacteria, it's about balancing populations. This is why I am not a huge fan of blue light. In addition to that, it is the same type of light that is emitted from screens, phones, TVs, computers, that disrupts your circadian rhythm. So. Personally, I recommend using red or ideally infrared to address the inflammation in the skin caused by the breakouts, as opposed to neutralizing the bacteria itself. Why LED is so essential. I include LED light therapy in almost every single facial that I offer. And it again is something that I suggest to all of my clients to use at home. And this is because we're not just affecting the skin when we're using this modality, we're touching on multiple systems. Light therapy helps nervous system regulation. Most of my clients will fall asleep underneath the red light because it drops the body into that parasympathetic state of rest and digest, which is the only time collagen and elastin is produced. It helps support gut health, which in turn helps support skin health. Light therapy supports barrier health, reducing inflammation and strengthening barrier lipids. LED addresses the fascia in the connective tissue. Light travels through the tissue, improving tone and reducing stagnation. And lastly, light therapy influences cellular regeneration. Healthier mitochondria equals healthier skin. This is something I've been trying to impart to you throughout all of my videos. But when it comes to addressing aging in the skin, we have to go to the source and at the source is the cell. So by supporting cellular health, you support skin health. LED is one of the only modalities where you can see an improvement in the skin's behavior, not just surface changes. Light therapy on its own or partnered with microcurrent not only will address whatever your specific concerns are, but they will improve the overall health and function of your skin and your body as a whole, which is why I find it to be an essential modality to include in your at-home skincare routine. LED light therapy has clinically proven skin benefits. And while there are a lot of studies out there that support this, I'm gonna share some of current body's clinical studies since we'll be talking about their products a little bit later. LED has been shown to reduce wrinkles by up to 30%, increase skin plumpness by 57%, boost brightness by 27%, reduce redness by 19%, and improve overall skin texture and evenness. In addition to this, you'll also see a stronger barrier function, faster healing, less inflammation, and more resilience over time. This is why I always say LED is a long game. So not only are you gonna see immediate results, and I find that that reduction in redness and inflammation is what you see after a single use, but you're also going to see long-term skin improvements. So each time you're using your device, you're not just improving the immediate health of your skin, you're setting it up for success for 10 years down the line. LED light therapy isn't just for the face, it can be used all over the body and even on the scalp. Red wavelengths work beautifully on the scalp because the hair follicle is a living structure. Current Body makes a hair growth helmet. I've previously dedicated an entire video to scalp health with a focus on 
their LED helmet, which uses clinically proven red wavelengths to increase hair density, reduce shedding, and improve overall scalp health. Current Body's clinical studies with their hair growth helmet have shown an increase in hair growth by 123%, a reduction in hair loss by 72%, an increase in thickness by 26%, and an improvement in scalp hydration by 15%. Some of these numbers are kind of insane right? 123% increase in hair density. I personally love pairing my light therapy on my scalp with scalp massage, peptide serum use, and other topicals like rosemary for follicle support. I'll put a link to my scalp health video in the show notes down below. When you're shopping for an LED mask, there are four things that truly determine whether or not your device is actually going to work. So the first is power. How much energy is each LED bulb actually delivering to the skin? Too low and you won't see results. The second is precision. The LEDs need to emit wavelengths as close as possible to the clinically proven ranges, ideally within 10 nanometers, where the light won't activate the cellular pathways that we want. Then we need to think about color coverage. How evenly are the LEDs covering the entire face? Gaps, shadows, and bulbs sitting too far from the skin will dramatically reduce the effectiveness of the treatment. And finally, duration. The treatment time needs to be optimized alongside power so that your skin receives enough total energy per session. When all four of these factors are aligned, your mask can deliver clinical grade photo biomodulation at home. So if you're looking for a device that covers all four of these bases, the Series 2 LED mask from Current Body is your best bet. And in addition to their face masks, Current Body's hair growth helmet is also FDA cleared. It offers hand-free use for the whole head, comes in two different sizes, and offers Bluetooth speakers inside the helmet so you can listen to something while you're doing your 10 minute light therapy treatment. Now for the part you've all been waiting for, Current Body's Black Friday sale. My code KDCB gives you 20% off of all of Current Body's LED devices. Okay, so let's get into some of these offerings. There's an LED face and hair kit, the Series 2 LED mask, the LED hair growth helmet, and lastly, the face and neck kit. Again, this is Current Body's biggest sale of the year. So if you've been thinking about adding a light therapy device into your routine, I highly suggest shopping for one now because it's the best time to save. Now, we've been talking about light therapy devices, but my discount code works site wide. So that means that it would also work on their PEMF mats, their sauna blankets, and possibly their compression pants. Last time I checked, the compression therapy was only available in the UK. I'm not sure if that's been updated since I was told that. We'll have to find out. But there are a lot of really amazing offerings over at Current Body, in addition to shopping the Zip Halo microcurrent device as well. I will put links and discount codes in the show notes down below. Okay, how to integrate light therapy into your daily routine. So. Ideally, you're gonna use your LED mask on clean, dry skin. You can layer a hydrating or ideally antioxidant serum underneath your light mask. However, you need to make sure that you avoid using anything photosensitive, AHAs, BHAs, uh, so any sort of acids, hyaluronic acid does not count. That's a humectant, not an exfoliant, but any sort of exfoliating acids, retinol, anything that would cause sensitivity in sunlight, you want to avoid using underneath your mask. To make it easy, cleanse and tone and call it a day. Once you remove your mask, you can go right into any products of your choosing. That is when you can layer in those acids and retinols, any of the actives you might be using in your routine, apply them after your light use. Now, if you are combining light therapy with 
other modalities like microcurrent, there is no wrong way to layer them. You could do light therapy, then microcurrent, or microcurrent, then light therapy. I personally like using the light before I do microcurrent just because it tends to warm the tissues a little bit, making the microcurrent more readily received by the skin. But again, there is no wrong or right way in layering those two devices. For all of my lazy ladies like me, at home. I put my light mask next to my bed. I hit my alarm in the morning. I put it on snooze and I throw that mask on my face. My skin's clean. I did it the night before. And as long as I didn't use retinol that evening, I'm totally fine to just throw that mask on first thing in the morning. Is it clean, dry skin? Maybe not quite, but for me, the device that I use regularly is better than any device that I'm not using. Ease of use is a big part of integrating treatments into your routine. So if it's seamless to do it first thing in the morning, don't stress it. Use your light when you have time to use your light. Try to use it three to five times a week for the full 10 minute treatments and continue consistent use for at least eight weeks so that you can start to see some of those clinical results we talked about earlier. If you're integrating the hair growth helmet into your routine, you're gonna shoot for 10 minute treatments every single day to really see that 123% increase in hair density. Amazing. And again, remember consistency is key. So find a time that works for your routine, add in your light therapy and do it regularly. Stick with it. Otherwise you're not going to see the results that you're wanting to achieve. I love including red light both in my professional facials and in my personal home care routine. It is such a multifunctional treatment that has benefits in every aspect of health. My clients fall asleep under the red light. It activates that parasympathetic state. Their redness decreases and their skin is glowing after a treatment. Elasticity improves. And if they're using it at home regularly, you're gonna see an increase in collagen, a decrease in fine lines and wrinkles, and the skin becomes more resilient because it's healthier and stronger. And if you're integrating light therapy at home on your scalp, you're gonna see a reduction in shedding and an increase in hair strength and density. If you haven't already included red light into your at-home routine, I'm really excited to see how this new addition might create shifts in your skin health and your overall well-being. Microcurrent and LED light therapy are the two at-home modalities I consider essential because they support the skin at a cellular level, not just a surface level. There are a lot of devices out there, but few of them can claim this. So when I'm suggesting devices to clients, I wanna make sure that we're really setting their skin up for success. And the best way I know to do that is through cellular support. If you're interested in exploring more of Current Body's offerings, I'm gonna put links to all of the devices we talked about down below, along with my discount code, KDCB, which gives you 20% off site-wide at currentbody.com. If you have any additional LED questions, make sure you leave them in the comments down below. If you found this video helpful, make sure you give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel already, make sure you subscribe. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you just had the most wonderful Thanksgiving. I can't believe Christmas is right around the corner. Happy holidays, everyone, and I will see you really soon.